because if you're trying to make YouTube your main hub, then you definitely want to be promoting it as much as you possibly can. Are you ready to start and grow a YouTube channel in 2020 and finally grow it from zero subscribers to over a hundred fast? My name is Julian Astrovska from julianastrovska.com. Welcome back to my channel. Super excited to see you here. This is the best place for coaches, consultants, and entrepreneurs who are looking to monetize their expertise on social media. So without further ado, let's go ahead and dive right into this as I'm about to share with you seven different tips and strategies how you can grow your YouTube channel faster. Okay, so let's go ahead and dive right in. And by the way, if you don't have your first 100 subscribers yet, then be sure to check this video right here. I'm also gonna link it down below in the description box. So watch it after this video. All right, so let's go ahead and dive right into the tips and strategies. So strategy number one to growing your YouTube channel fast is promote your channel on all social media platforms. Promote it on Facebook, promote it on Instagram, promote it on Twitter, promote it on Pinterest, everywhere. I don't care even if you're not using all these platforms, but you have to start promoting your content on all of them, even if you're not very active. You can always schedule posts, you can always get them pre-planned and get them scheduled ahead of time. Even if you have a video that you posted two months ago, go ahead and schedule it to go out on Twitter for the next coming months. Like create a couple of different tweets and schedule them using Hootsuite or Buffer or one of those scheduling tools. If you have a video, also schedule it out on Pinterest, create some graphics using Canva and schedule them out months ahead. So strategy number two to growing fast on YouTube, which I already have mentioned, but promote your content on Pinterest. And this is something that a lot of content creators don't realize is Pinterest is not a social media platform. Pinterest is really a search engine, just like Google, just like YouTube, and people go there all the time and your content can actually get ranked. And I did a research on that myself. I you went into Google incognito window and I typed in several different keywords that I've been looking at and I found out that Pinterest does rank images really, really well if you do your job at optimizing them. So definitely do that. Okay, so strategy number three to growing your YouTube channel fast to over 100 subscribers is go ahead and put your videos into your blog posts because blog posts can also be distributed so you can post them on social media you can post them on pinterest you can schedule them out into various different uh, methods you can email your list right so if you already have an existing list you can send a message to your many chat subscribers if you are building a messenger bot uh, subscriber base so there's so many different ways but definitely put it on your article because that's another way for you to rank on google and if your article ranks on google then people get to that website they get to that page and they also get to see that youtube video so tip number four to growing fast on youtube also add your youtube channel to your email signature because a lot of the times you would have clients message you, you would have, you know, brands even message you, you would have companies, um, you know, not message you, but email you. So that's what you can do is you can have a signature, you know, your name, what you do, your position in your company, and you can have social media links. You can have Instagram, you can have Facebook, you can have your Facebook group, and you can have your YouTube channel because if you're trying to make YouTube your main hub, then you definitely want to be promoting it as much as you possibly can. Tip number five to growing on YouTube fast promote every single video on your Insta stories. So if you're active on Instagram, which if you're not, I don't know why, <laughs> why not? Because that's such a great platform to position your personal brand and to start getting clients for your business. So if you're not using Instagram, check out this playlist right here where I talk all about Instagram and different strategies that you can use to get found by your potential clients and customers. But without diving into this too terribly much, definitely promote your videos on Insta stories because in the feed, it's not always gonna give you as much exposure as the Insta stories because Instagram stories are there at the top, so everybody's seeing them. And if you have a small following, then, you know, that's a great way to engage your current following to get all of them into your YouTube channel like that. And you should do this in the first 24 hours when you post your video on your channel, because that is going to give you that boost of traffic 
and then your video is going to get ranked potentially in the YouTube platform as well. So tip number six to growing fast on YouTube. So if you have freebies, if you have lead magnets, which is basically a free cheat sheet, a free tutorial, free something that you give away to your audience in exchange for an email address. So you can check an example right here, my social media content calendar. I'm going to link for it down below this video where I basically will give you an entire calendar with the whole, with the whole plan to post your social media content. So you don't have to struggle with what I'm going to post with how I'm going to post it. So you don't have to struggle with content ideas ever. So that's for the entire year of 2020 and you can still use it for the next year because I'm going to be updating this every single year. So you can also add in your freebies, your YouTube channel, because when people download your things, then they would also want to connect with the creator. They would be like, okay, so where can I check that person out? You know, like she seems to be pretty cool. So how do I check out more of her? So that's a great way to get your traffic into YouTube because those are actually your email subscribers. And that's a more valuable person in your audience than just a cold person on the Instagram or on the interwebs. So, and tip number seven, this is something that I just recently tested and it has worked pretty well. So post your longer form trainings on YouTube and direct people there. And I'll explain to you how I did this. So a couple of weeks ago, I hosted a free Facebook challenge inside of my Facebook group. And it was a challenge with five videos. Each video was about 20 to 30 minutes. And I personally had issues with Facebook to where they were putting me into Facebook jail. Some videos I couldn't even stream into my Facebook group because I have been using Zoom. So this has been a whole challenge for me, for me in itself, right? It just got to the point where some videos have not been working. Some of them couldn't be played on Facebook for some reason. So what I did, you know, my number one solution for that was, okay, I'm going to go ahead and post them all on YouTube. And at first I made them unlisted, but then I thought to myself, okay, so why don't I try to make them public? And that also attracted a lot of cold people to my audience. And while I added those videos there, my YouTube channel grew by, you know, a couple dozen subscribers. <laughs> okay. So that has been pretty awesome because these were the people who were in my existing audience on Facebook, but they didn't know that I also had a YouTube channel, right? So they had been participating in my Facebook challenge. They have been engaging my Facebook group. But then when I showed them that, Hey, like these videos are hosted on YouTube, they were like, oh, like she also has a YouTube channel and she's got over a hundred videos over there talking about all kinds of things, marketing, coaching, and social media. So that has been such a great way for me to not only increase my watch time, but also drive my existing audience, like my hot audience into my YouTube channel. All right. So, so far I shared with you how to start and grow a successful YouTube channel using the seven different tips, hacks, strategies, call them however you want. And if you're just starting out and you already have a hundred subscribers, then you may want to learn how to monetize your YouTube channel with that small following before you even get YouTube monetization. So I did a video right here where I talk about different money making strategies on YouTube, how you can grow even with a small YouTube channel. So be sure to check that out. And did you enjoy this video? If you did give it a like, be sure to hit the subscribe button and hit the bell sign down below this video to get notified when the new video goes live which is going to be in the next couple of days. So with that being said, check out these two videos right here to learn more about video marketing and social media. Let me know into the comments if this video has been valuable because I would love to know if this is helpful and you want me to do any similar videos on this topic. And without any further ado, let's wrap this up and uh, I will see you in the next video. Bye.